Let me say that uh, before I started coming, I saw a social media chat where platform where they say that you should describe Senator Enini Abaribe in one word. And I was tempted to simply respond to that without being here. But I had a compulsion to be here. And I responded quickly. He is a colossus. I don't know how else to describe a man of many parts. And that was why when I was trying to recognize him, I did take our minds back to where he started. I got to know him first and foremost as a deputy governor in Abia State. And while a deputy governor in Abia, Abia State, he was a strong deputy governor. The, former, the, speaker, the speaker said if you, that when the, when the book is read, the book must be controversial. I think the controversy uh, the speaker is talking about started in his days as the deputy governor of Abia State. But I think also I need to say that uh, a public life without controversy is not complete. There must be something, there must be a time you will challenge the status quo. There must be a time you will take a stand that everybody must not be comfortable with. There must be a time you will stand out whether people like it or not. And I think that would have dotted the history of Senator Abaribe. It's a history that is dotted with firm conviction on issues, whether the crowd goes the same way with him or against him. He will stand his ground, he will make his point, he will push his point, and he will defend his point. My brother, I wish to be like you. <laughs> Let me also say that I am privileged to be here today. I have not read the book. When I came in, uh, the former governor of uh, Imo State was speaking. He did say he had not read the book. I have not read the book. But I know that if I re read the book and read through the stories of, uh, the story of uh, Senator Baribe, told by Senator Baribe, it will make an interesting read. It will be an inspiration to many, more particularly for the younger ones who are coming up. There is something I see in a man that attracts me and endears me to that man. And that is actually my admiration for, uh, for Senator Abaribe, which many would not know. Your ability to take decisions. Not what you have, not what you open your mouth to say, but the decisions you make and how you stand to the end on those decisions. If there is anything I know Senator Baribe about, and if there is anything I want to see in the book, is how he has navigated through his public career. The decisions he had made at various points that were not convenient and comfortable with many, and he stood on those decisions to the end. I know that today people think that uh, politics is about you know, your ability to move to this side or ability to, to swerve. But Senator Baribe, I want to read your, the, the history of your life told by yourself. It will inspire me, it will encourage me, and it will make me more be like you. I thank you. Thanks for checking out Symphony on YouTube. Please be sure to subscribe and like our videos for updates.